Hi, it's Jo from Cranberry here and this delicious selection of beads on my bead mat are Omiyuki. These are the latest Duracoat colours and this latest range they have out, the Delica beads, which are these, match the seed beads, which are these. And at the moment they only come in size 11 seed beads, but I'm sure they must be frantically making some other sizes in the Miyuki factory as we speak. I hope they are anyway. So, as you may or may not know, um, the Delica beads are cylinders, so they have straight sides, and the seed beads are more rounded. Okay, so both have their uses, and some of you may be fans of one, some of you may be fans of the other, but you can just grab whichever one you prefer now, or maybe both, like I have, because these colours are amazing, okay? And I've had a few questions as to whether how you can tell which one goes with which. Now, quite often, Miyuki Delica numbers do not match at all with the seed bead numbers, okay? Now, in this range, there is a slight correlation, and I will explain that to you now. So let me just take this delicious tube here, which matches with this packet here, okay? Now, as you can see, Purple Orchid Duracoat, okay? So they have the same name. They have partly the same code. So there's 17 colours in this new range, and the seed beads start at 5105 and go to 511, sorry, 5101 to 5117, okay? So, 5 1 with 1 to 17, and they are in this order. The Delicas start at 2501 and go to 2517. Okay, so the seed beads start with 5 1, the Delicas start with 2 5, but the last number in the code is what you're looking for to match them. Okay. Now, I know that is a little bit complicated, but it's the most uh, similar numbering system that I've seen so far between the seed beads and the delicas. So that is what you're looking for if you're looking for an exact match. And I know the light is a bit glary off of this here, but um, trust me, they are really great match. Really great match. So... The colours that we have here are just stunning, okay? So we've got a couple of new golds. We've got a pale gold, and then we've got a yellow gold, okay? So it definitely is a bit yellowier than the pale gold. Then we've got a bright copper, which is a little bit pinky, actually, but... Um, if you see that sort of bright copper, hmm, it's difficult to describe. It's definitely um, quite light, but a bit of a pinky shade as well. Then we have got a um, light champagne, this one here. So there's already a champagne, and uh, that is just a slightly different shade to it. And we've got two yummy greens. Now, the first one is a dark mint green. And then that's 5105. And the dark aqua green is the 5106. Then we've got this lovely moss black. Okay. Really quite a different sort of black. Really interesting. Okay, and there's the matching Delica number. Then we move on to some purples. Um, yes, 
Purples have been lacking in the Duracoat range for a little while, but these are stunning. We've got the Purple Orchid, which is slightly pinker tones, and then we move on to the slightly bluer tones in the Dark Lilac and the Lilac Night. So, delicious. Then we've got a navy, which is really lovely. That matches this one here, the delicate. So that's five, one, one, one. And then we have a steel green. So it's quite dark. This is sort of almost like a nickel color, but with a green tinge. So that's, um, it's a bit darker than the nickel maybe. And then we have a lovely range of blues. So let me pull these round. This is the Capri Blue, 5113. The Dark Capri Blue, so you can see the differences there. And then we have Poseidon Blue, which is quite an unusual colour, actually. More towards the greeny tones, slightly tealy. And then the Deep Aqua Blue. And the Mermaid Blue, which is going back slightly to the um, purpley colours a little bit. That's the Delica to match it to. Okay. So if you are a fan of shiny beads, whether you like Delicas, whether you like seed beads, I would recommend that you grab some of these. So as you can see, we have the whole range in the 11s seed beads and the Delicas. Highly recommended. I've been using them quite a bit and I love them. Okay, that's it from me now.